let's get to our hovercraft. Like how they're like forcing me to take it. Got the mission on our way. Also, we should probably heal. Unless we automatically got healed. And it looks like we did. And that was a waste of all those magic apples. But it won't matter in a minute. Let's go get the hovercraft from down here. Fucking rocks. Oh, other way. Good thing they didn't, like, steal your hovercraft. Also, this never became a thing. I guess it's something from a previous game. Three to the right. One to the left. Two to the left. It was two to the left? I thought it was one to the left. See, I'm terrible at remembering things like that. <clears throat> I actually uh, lost my locker combination several times and I learned how to crack locks when I was younger. Um, at least master those like crappy combination master locks. So some of them you can pop off the faceplate, actually go into it, pull out some of the some of the guts. And you can reach up and actually take a pin and pull the latch, and then it comes unlocked. So for a while, I just literally had a front face on my locker, and I used to open it up and just take a paper clip and open it. Then I had another one where I had to keep the combination thing on me at like all times. And then I lost it, so I did the, uh, the little J. Jimmy thing where you take a flat piece from a soda can or something and you sneak it down the side of where the lock is and then you just pop the little trap and then it unlocks so I was unlocking it that way for a while so I constantly have to get soda cans because I'd lose my J or my J would get bent up or something and it wouldn't work anymore All right, but enough adventures and fuck let's exit out of that ignore that it wasn't anything suspicious well, any more suspicious than most of the things I will, will do. Okay. Okay, that's weird that it... Okay, this guilt, this FAQ has things out of order. Alright. So, I can go up. I have to hit all the levers. So let's get through this. So basically, I'm doing a straight shot here. This actually is pretty easy, as long as you go to the left first. Otherwise, if you go to the right, it's a whole huge pain in the dick hole. Yeah, so there's landmines. You take a little bit of damage. It's actually like nothing. Oh, there'd be one there. 
another inferno powder, which I should do a bunch of crafting stuff, but I'll probably get the hovercraft first, then worry about that. Oh, that's just dick. We'll see. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to use Valheart very often, if ever. <clears throat> I kind of like what I'm doing right now. I mean, Valheart and Theo are just... Eh. I mean, he looks like a, he looks like a troll doll. He only has silver gear too. What a scrub! Plus, I'd rather just boost characters really high. So unless a character dies, I'm not really doing much. How about you get dead? How's that sound? I'm really glad that doesn't hurt party members. Oh, his little soul left his body. The FAQ had a warning that there are stronger crypt rats and the, there are fire elementals that can do a lot of damage. Boy, they, they sure did a number on me. I must be, like, super overleveled. Uh, probably from the battleship, because I kept going back and forth. Rat reagent. Light alloy. That's always nice. Pull the lever. So I'm gonna have to do the battle again. Yep. Oh, good, she's about to gain a level. She is right now the lowest in my regular party. Seriously? Yes. I do kind of like their death animation. Well, he's dead. I've always hated enemies that commit suicide in games. I always feel like it's experience lost. You really need more movement speed. Nah, that did okay damage. I mean, it wasn't like, oh my god, so life threatening. I mean, maybe if like two or three of them blew up on him, but it was only one, so. Not really a big deal. Pack through the minefield. Walk through minefields. Figured there by the rocks, considering every time I went by a rock, it blew up. Not really a good way to set up your mine field. Set up your mine. Dur Anyway. Jesus, this room is huge.
Oh, wait a minute. There's treasure in here. Wait a minute. No, there isn't. This is the trap room. Yeah, invisible floors. <sighs> yeah, if there were monster battles in there, come on, get on. I would probably want to throw something. So let's just make this quicker. Okay, can you get through there? Thank you. Yeah, I put the frame limiter on because it will with frame limit off, it will go up to like 160 frames or something like that. Okay, this doesn't say there's monsters here. Interesting. Dungeon Mouse. Oh, he did a lot more damage. Cobra. Cobra's really a big deal. I mean, I probably should have done her special to do that. Well, you can't silence her. One damage, really? Yes, get nice and close. Nothing bad can happen while you're there. No, certainly no one has big spells that can hit all of you. I particularly like Lutz going first. I'm the leader. I go first. Just save there. Okay, the next room is a minefield. I didn't put an X there, buttholes. Oh, I didn't even see that rock there. Speaking of which, I should probably you know, just do some quick recover just to make sure. Just a CYA. Supposed to be another treasure in here. 
There it is. Huh, I walked past that rock. Usually you don't want anything identifying what you can, what you have there. So that way people, you know, can't avoid your mines. It's usually a good idea. Or put them in front of something they would be more interested in. Like people like Viet Cong putting a whole weapons cache and putting a landmine in front of it because they know they were screwed. So they'd put their weapons on the other side of a bunch of landmines. So that way, if people went to take them, the whole thing would just blow up. But, as for these, I mean, they're not even that strong. I would lose at the rope climbing part. I'd be like, well, this is where I die. I guess nobody's succeeding. I guess the dart traps are only active when... Oh, son of a bitch. Oh my god, did it drop me all the way back? I really hope it didn't. Let's not do that again. I imagine they're going to make me take the worst path ever. I figured as much. I really hope you like reseeing this part over and over again. Okay. So it was the other way. I really like when music restarts at the exact same point. All that's borked. Kind of wish one wish with blah, blah, blah. Kind of wish once you uh, fell through it once, it would at least show you. Or say like X. So let's just quick save here. Okay, so not there. Oh, really? I guess if you go here, yep. Okay, this part of the music is actually much more annoying. <laughs> That's the most evilest thing I've ever seen. Oh, that for a palo nut? Fuck off. Treasure! Treasure! So let me see something. Okay. Let me just see here. So, 
There's something special I have to do in the next one. So let me just do this. So you need to go... <clears throat> Alright. So there's a Recopod string column and Brad. And then return back one room, wind your way clockwise to the chest. The chest you find in the holy room has a palo knot. To get it, you need to go counterclockwise, then north. Is this the one? Yes. There we go. There we go. Okay. I just wanted to make sure. That's annoying. Well, I mean, I guess you'd get it if you fell down a couple times. You'd see it. It's just a time waster, really. GBA puzzle. Another battle? Yep. Another battle that they didn't mark on the map. Hats off to you, map makers, for failing. Dirty emojis. That should hopefully fuck him up. I imagine if he's flying, rocks would hurt him a lot. Well, aren't you guys little bastards? Good, I didn't get homojied. Damn, she dodged it. Oh, no, she didn't. She was just making an extremely long wince face. <coughs> Jesus. I felt that coming and I tried to like stifle it and made it worse. I hate coughing. Surprisingly from smoking, I don't cough too often. I feel like vape has made me cough a little bit more, but... Mm. You know what? Uh, he'll probably just recover him, so... That did some damage. Yeah, you can go ahead and recover. Damn. Holy shit, you recovered two of them? Well, isn't that some shit? Uh, I don't like that. At least that does a little bit less damage. So I have to have Cheryl go over and heal her. Cheryl. Uh, actually, I want to get you down here. It's not much, but it'll keep her from dying right away. Surprised he didn't recover. Hmm. 
music in this really reminds me of Shining Force. Actually, let's see something. Really? I guess that was really good. Save here. Oh, all that for a magic apple? Imagine the dragonflies will probably both move over. Both of them. Good. And level up for you. Time for you to die. Monster scum. All right. So, speaking of which, I'm not healing her for one hit point. Let's get super serious. Hey. Ignore the ticks and rest here for a while. Mm. Uh, hunting for some pubic life shampoo. Some complimentary scabies. Alright. Oh, Jesus. There's a lot of shit here. This dungeon is a little intense. No, do not minimize that ever. Okay. So, I'm gonna need this up. There's a lot of battles in here. Let's see. So this is apparently a terrible ladder puzzle. Um, okay. Keep heading south. Okay. So there's a screen breakaway as I was wondering what the tilde was. I mean, when you want something secret, and the worst part is there'll probably be like a door that opens to get the hovercraft back out. Okay, mysterious ore, which is awesome. Perfect. All right, grab the mysterious ore. Double back one screen to take the southern three eastern passages. Yeah. yeah. What the fuck? Don't get lost already. There, let me see something. Follow the E rope. So let me look on here and see. Ow. No, you wanted me to go all the way back to the beginning. Let's see. 
follow to the E rope and continue north on the first screen. What the fuck? Is he saying the same thing twice? Double back one screen and take the southern of the three east passages. This leads to a rope down. And that's D. Where the fuck is D? I see one D. Oh, okay. Yeah, so this is right. He just doesn't... Why would you put the names of the ropes there and then not just say, Hey, this is rope, which is rope D. Like, what the fuck? Goddamn idiot. I hate when people are indescript in FAQs. Also, fuck doing this otherwise. Alright. Go to E and continue north into the first screen. This sends me back to the beginning, that was totally pointless. Because he said E goes to here. Yeah, and that one's blocked. So do you want me F or G? Wow, this person is screwy. Like, the sentences, I think sometimes people don't proofread them, or have people try to check them. Because it says, Mysterious Rock, go back up and take the G rope over to the H rope, follow south to number 16 item. And he doesn't have a number 16 item listed here. Oh, okay, there it is, it's all the way up there. But still, you could just say, go back out, use the furthest right. He says, use the middlemost rope. Like, fuck off. Jesus. Well, since there's nowhere else to go. There should be another mysterious aura right down here. <coughs> there you go. Tough alloy. It's not possible to go west or south. Go west. Thanks for that. Alright. Arc counterclockwise out of here. This should be rope K. Okay. 